Master mode. Yeah, 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 yeah. Master mode. Man. That's, uh, that, that is nasty. Must mode ain't messing around. This is gonna be a nasty play for us. Looks like a whole, there's a little Bacobin skull there as well. I don't remember that being there before. Um. Okay. That's where I'm going, right? Oh. Is that where I'm going? No, that's not where I'm going. Well, I'll mock that anyway. Oh yeah. God, I've forgotten how it feels to have like no stamina in this game. This could be this gonna be fun. I like this. This is gonna be a lot more challenging now. Uh, oh, did it, did it, done it, got it. How'd you save in this? I've forgotten. That and then that and then save. Good, there you go. Gotta remember to save. Gotta remember to save. Save regularly in this mode, that's for sure. Some boys were there. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna need like a good weapon. I'm gonna need a good fast weapon. That axe is too slow for me right now. Oh, those are gonna kick my ass if I go near those. I guess I'm going this way. But do you rank Breath of the Wild compared to others? Um, some are mid, some are mid to top. Uh, my biggest, a big problem I had with this was I didn't like the new temple designs. I miss old temples. Uh, oh shit, look at those. Those are cool. Those are the new things they added, aren't they? Those are like all over the place now. I miss, um, I miss the old temples. The new temples in this are pretty da are pretty bad, honestly. Um, pretty dad. <laughs> Pretty dad, you know. Um, and I also I kind of just miss a lot of the music that was in the old games. But this is definitely one of the best Zelda games I played. It's a, it's it's between this and Wind Waker for me for my favorite ones. I got around you, you son of a bitch. There's no way I'm gonna be able to kill him with that axe as well. Hey, clone. Yeah, I'd like a I'd like a combo of the old and new for the next game. I'd like him to bring back the old temples, but keep this kind of style of of, of open world gameplay. Because I love the world they've created here. Um, yeah, I would I prefer I would prefer like better temples and more music, more more overworld music, please. The penises rise from the ground. Rise from your grave. I don't think I'm gonna go for like an all thing, like trying to get everything that possibly is to get in this, by the way. I'm just gonna do like a playthrough at sort of like a cool, moderate pace and try the DLC out and stuff like that. I wanna get the sweet, I wanna get the sweet motorbike. I don't know how you get the motorbike, but I wanna get it. Stuff like that. I did watch a bit of that video clone, yeah. 
It's, it's good. I liked it. I liked it. I expected it first to be like a guide to cooking, and then I was like, oh no, it's, it's like a Bob Ross thing. It was good stuff. A single tear falls from my cheek. That's what the, do you know what these are, right? These are the penises of the ground. They come out the ground, they rise out the ground, they erect out the ground, and then they drip a single penis tear. Right down on them. Oh god, that electric boss is gonna be horrendous, Golden Games. <laughs> Oh lord. Preggers, yeah. They, they, the, the, the penis tower just impregnated my Sheikah sleep. Also, I wish there was like a more proper Ganondorf in this. Gan I feel like a Ganondorf's. Gandalf in this um, was a bit of a letdown for me. Oh yeah, the bosses as well. Yeah, that's another thing. The bosses in this game originally were way too easy. I don't know how they're going to be now, but they were stupid easy before. It was just it was all just a case of shooting the eye. Like they wasn't that they didn't have kind of the cool sort of mechanics that you'd have to deal with. But then the bosses typically in the other games all came about the mechanics and were all based on the items you'd got in that temple. And in this one, you don't get items as you go. You have them all at the start. So I don't know. I, I'd be okay with a Zelda game that was maybe not like you can do any temple in any order you want. But, um. Was maybe more of a. Alright, that's the ones I need. But uh, it doesn't have to be like do every temple in any order you want, but it could be like a. Um, just have the open world this, but still have a slightly more decide like focused direction where you to go in. So it could still give you like items as you went for a bit more variety. Oh ho ho Give me that give me that thing, you old man. Crying the penis eye. Yeah, it was from it was from Kato Shoujo, the penis eye song. It makes me want to cry from my penis eye. My, my, you seem we have quite the enigma here. This tower and others just like it have erupted it across the land, one after another. It's almost as though a long dormant power has awoken. Oh, my long dormant power has awoken. If you do not mind me asking, did anything odd occur while you were atop that tower? Well, I did. An old man offered to touch me. That was weird. Ooh. Well, now, a voice, you say. Dude, did you happen to recognize this mysterious voice? Shift the progression in the game. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. I didn't recognize it, no. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> you know, uh, it's my daughter, you know. I assume you caught sight of that atrocity, uh, atrocity enshrined in the castle. That is Calamity Ganon. One hundred years ago, that vile entity brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin. It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its path. So many innocent lives were lost in its wake. For a century, the very symbol of our kingdom, Hyrule Castle, was managed to contain that evil, but just barely. There it festers, building its strength for the moment it will unleash its blood upon the land once again. It would appear the moment is fast approaching. I don't know what this voice I'm giving him is. <laughs> I must say, you, uh, courageous one, I must ask you, courageous one, do you intend to make your way to the castle? Eh, I suppose. Also, I'm really sick of fake dialogue options in games. Don't, don't, don't give me the illusion of choice. Just, just move it on. Just move it on, man. I had a feeling you would have saved that. Here on this isolated plateau, we're surrounded on all sides by steep cliffs. No way down. Do you think the next Zelda will be a child Zelda one? Hmm. 
Of course, if you had a, power, a, a paraglider like mine, that'd be quite another story. Hand it over. Oh, certainly, why not? But there's no such thing as free item in this world, you know. Let's see now. How about I trade it for a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby? All right, I'll do it. Old man. Come on, let me show you something, all right. I'm with you, muscle man. You're a lot bigger than me. Muscly. Oh, just fat. I, I can't tell. You don't look that fat. Oh, see that structure there? The one shining with a strange light? I do. Began glowing the exact moment those towers rose up from the ground. I'd think such a place might house some sort of treasure, wouldn't you? A treasure for a paraglider, a fair exchange, I believe. All right, will do. Oh, God damn, there's so many creatures over there. I need, like, a good weapon. I, before I start fighting, boys, I gotta get a good weapon on me. This axe is way too slow. No! Shush! Oh, no! <laughs> There's no one over here. Go away. Go away. Go away. Stop. Stop blowing your horns. Stop it. Oh, my lord. Yeah, you can't get me. Maybe you can. Oh, he's drowning. Oh, no. Are these fire arrows? I think one of them just drowned over there. <laughs> I wonder if I can get his stuff. God, Jesus, stop vibrating, stop vibrating for... Jesus, lordy, lord, lord. How does he make arrows again? I can't know if you find arrows or if you make arrows, I don't remember. Uh, I think you like... Yeah, I can't remember what it is. You think it's like stone and wood. I can't remember what it is. I actually don't remember how you do arrows in this game. Don't kill the trumpet, it's my dream. It's my dream. I've got my Fitbit to like vibrate whenever someone sends me a message. And I just got sent like, I swear I just got sent like five messages at once. And my, my wrist is like, mm. How's it going? It's going to be an electrical shock, dude. Oh, yes. Maybe I can get like cool treasure out of that. Right. This better be the magnet one now. Oh shit, EX. What does that mean? Oh, this is one of those, one of those little uh, things you get from the DL. You know what? I'll take those. I fucking need them. I did notice that the things holding them up look like Oct the Octoroks. That's pretty cruel. Hit the sack, Jack! Hit the sack, Jack! Can you get a Fitbit for your dick? <laughs> well, okay, first of all, you gotta get the Fitbit for your dick. Then what you need to do is you need to have people message you constantly until you've, you've gone off. Quick, send me a message. Oh. <laughs> send, 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 send. 
Um, Micah Boy, thank you for five months in a row. Micah Boy turn. Micah Boy turn. He's Micah Boy. Micah Boy. Yeah, Micah Boy. Should we also incorporate a no fast travel? Or should we not incorporate that? A no fast travel, no looking at the map rule. Don't play with the map one. It's a good idea, that, to be fair. No running, no walking, only swimming. <laughs> we'll see how I feel about that. I might, I might be like, no, I need a fast travel. Oh, man, I will. Oh, my... Wow, Shindaru. How about, how about no walking, only fast travel? <laughs> I'm only allowed to fast travel. I cannot actually move in the game. I can only fast travel. Right on cue for my cat to like meow. Do you want to come in? Come on in. Ah, uh, the the uh, Patty, our resident cat. <laughs> Patty, we here you go. All right, we got the magnet. We got the magnet! And I always find it really hard to sleep after sleeping with a significant other for a month and then they go away again. Um, I'm not the best sleeper anyway, to be fair. Oh, well, this is one of my favorite parts of this game, to be fair, was finding, like, wacky ways to do stuff with, the, with these. Ah! How could you- I can't remember how you rotate stuff in this. If you even can. I know this is not how you do this, but we're gonna- we're gonna try this, okay? <laughs> Actually, I, I don't know what that achieved by me doing that. You know, fuck it, we're just gonna put him over there. Yeah, let me get, let me get over there. Oh, hello. I did love, I did love the way, um... I did love the way they let you solve these puzzles like in really wild ways. That was probably the best part of this game. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I overheat really fast. So when I was when I have jazz like at night, I like I will overheat stupid hard. Get out of the way, suckers! Ah. Oh, that's how we that's how we do. We're gonna have to invoke we're gonna have to invoke a lot of gravity killing to kill boys in this. That's how we do. We'll we'll, we'll kill a couple of moblins with gravity and then uh, <laughs> save ourselves a whole heap of problems. Get over here. Oh, nice flip. Only kill with powers. Only move by magnetism. 
Traveler's Boat. Much better bow. What's different about master mode? Um, all the enemies are like one tier up from what they were before. There's a new tier of enemies that are like golden. Um, all the enemies will passively regain health while, while you fight them if you're not hitting them, which is nasty. There's these like floating platforms all over the place now with dudes on them. Boys, get out of here. Yeah, I don't care about this. I don't know why I'm watching those. I've watched those like a hundred million times, and you see them a hundred million times more. Show me your next tip. Okay, what's the next tip? Oh, yeah, that's a good tip. That's a good tip. They tend to run when menaced by bees. That's nice. Going tra tracking for the Colombian jungle next Saturday. Ahoy! That's interesting. I'd be more, I mean, just don't get kidnapped by any Colombian drug lords or anything like that, right? <laughs> uh, it seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. All right, good. Uh, ooh, perhaps it uh, all become difficult. Uh, as one gets older, it will become more difficult to see what is right before one's own eyes. However, that which was once hidden from view can now often be clear, crystal clear. But perhaps that is not true for everyone. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, the appearance of the towers and the awakening of the shrine. Yes, you know. It's all connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on your hip. Paraguider, please. <laughs> if you had to finish speaking. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. The great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago. Or oh, so it was said. Meow, meow. It is interesting, however, to think some something like that survived all this time hidden away in a shrine. Ooh. These shrines are tucked away in these numerous places all across this land. On this plateau alone, I believe there are still three more. Bring the treasure from each of those shrines and I'll give you the paraglider. All right. I said treasure, but I never said there'd only be one treasure. Then you should have said treasures. Whether it's one treasure or four. Four treasure. Please get me four treasure. It's four treasures. You misled me. You misled me. You didn't mislead me. You just you just lied. You straight up lied, right? You just it, don't 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 act like you 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 hid the truth in like a crafty way. You just straight up lied to me. Since I'm feeling generous, I also teach you a trick for finding the shrines. It's also best to survey the area by looking from a high point. Let's see here. How about you make your way to the top of the tower again? Are you joking? Oh ho ho. Afraid not, but do not worry. I have another little trick to share with you for your efforts. Woo! <laughs> it's it's going to fuck me now, Penny. Fast travel! I will, I will do it this time, to be fair. See those blue icons? You should recognize the cave where you woke, uh, the shrine you came from, and the tower. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. Oh, so I heard quite some time ago. I don't know if it actually works as such. Mm 
I'm gonna get this treasure chest out of the ground. Ow! Excuse me, miss? That was very rude. Actually, say it like that. It boggles my 